where have I been? Oh, honestly, as you can probably hear in my voice, I've had the week from hell. I've had the beast yeah. from the east. Yes. Yes, we all have, haven't we? Um, I've had the beast from the east, as in the lurgy. Thanks to this one over here. In the last video, I said that Toby wasn't very well and my husband started with it. Well, my wonderful husband, as most men seem to do, didn't suffer for very long. Within 24 to 48 hours, my husband had managed to shift it. Me, on the other hand, no, no, no. It's now been a week since he decided to spread the love and um, oh my god this is the first time today I felt just a little tiny bit human only a little tiny bit I've actually shaved my leg shaved my armpits I'm like a new woman <laughs> my face had a shock when it was like being had makeup applied to it it was like what's going on you've not had your eyebrows filled in for weeks Lisa so don't get me wrong I still feel a bit ropey but I just had to get out of the house for at least an hour or so so guess where I'm finally attempting to go home sense yes I am so it only takes about 10-15 about minutes to get up to home sense where I live but I thought I'll just get out of the house see how I am I've got a bit of a headache to be honest but thought maybe a bit of fresh air and I mean or mine it is fresh today I just thought it'll both clear out our nostrils a little bit and I mean TMI but we're all friends here aren't we I'm I'm just dumbfounded how much snot and mucus one has produced in a week well I don't know in a day let alone a week my goodness um, I haven't been floored by a cold and a cough for this long or for months and months probably over 12 months actually I do get sniffles and things but I think when you're a mum you just don't get the chance to recover as quickly as when obviously you don't have kiddies you know to see to and oh, just I mean luckily for me my parents had Toby for um, a day for me earlier in the week because honestly I think something off the walking dead looked better than me that day i was just like no i can't i can't function i can't do anything i can't lift my head so my mum just said i'll have toe before you if you want so we had his nap at my mum's and i just stayed napping for like near enough the full day and i hate it i hate wasting a day obviously when you're ill you can't help it can you but oh god it was just I just hate lying in I've never been one for lying in bed and late lions and but oh when you're not feeling well and I mean I couldn't sleep anyway because every time I lay down I just started like these mass coughing fits so yeah it's not been a very good week so I've not really been I've not filmed anything because if I'm honest I've not felt up to it um like I said I couldn't even lift my head off the pillow the other week so I've just just not really been up to it so I thought Right, today's the day. I feel a little bit more human. Not 100%, but you know, <clears throat> I'm getting there. But I just thought, go up to Home Sense and TK Maxx, um, the store near me. It's like a combined store. So when you go in, downstairs is TK Maxx and upstairs is Home Sense. So I've not been well before Christmas. I might not last, I don't know. Just thought we'll wrap up warm nip out the house for an hour so like you said what it is it's quarter past 11 now so you should be okay for a little wander around shouldn't you yeah yeah, yeah. i'll go we'll go have a little wander around i'll show you what's uh, what's in store if anything decent my aim is to just go to home sense i can park hopefully right outside it and just have a little wander around see if totes lasts okay and then just come home, have some lunch, and then no doubt Toby will be ready for his nap. I think I will be. <clears throat> Honestly, it just took my energy just to wash and blow dry my hair and put some makeup on. I'm knackered. Yeah, so we're not far off being there. So uh, next time you see us, we shall be inside. Come on then, shall we go in? Ooh. 
you gonna get in a trolley? Yeah? Yeah, we're gonna go up in the lift. Yeah? Home sense. Yeah? Come on then. Press this button. Okay. Can you press the number one? That's it. Beautiful. They are 9.99. Gorgeous. They do them in gold as well. Pretty. They're all over these. So pretty. Doggy, you see the doggy? Look at the doggy here. What does the doggy do? Oh. <laughs> hmm. These are quite nice as well. It's like a marble with a wooden lid. Five ninety nine. Hmm. That's those. spotted these the marble coasters they're heavy six ninety nine they're like trimmed with silver hmm I think they might have to come home with me hmm. so they say you can't come to home sense and not get a candle I'm gonna get this one I can't smell it because I'm still full of the cold it's pretty, so we're just gonna go with it and hope that it smells nice. Uh, what oh. do you think? Uh, yeah? Yeah. Well, just got back from our little trip to Home Sense, and I'm glad we set off when we did, really, because it started snowing. Oh, that, that really took it out of me. <clears throat> We've only been out an hour. My head's still pounding. I don't think I'm still fit for the real world just yet. Um, so we're gonna. Go indoors, aren't we? Get warm. I'm gonna get some lunch 
and then I'll show you what I got. I didn't get a lot. Um, there wasn't really that much, to be honest. No major bargs, but I um, got a few things. But once we've had lunch and I've put Toby down for his nap, I'm probably just about last to be able to film what I've got. I don't know if you can uh, look at my nose. It's horrendous. Yeah, so we're going to get ourselves indoors now. And then once he's down for a nap, I'll show you what I picked up. Okay? Hi, everyone. Um, Toby's just gone down for his little afternoon siesta. Again, bear with me, I'm running out of steam. So um, I'm just going to show you what I've got from Home Sense when we knit this morning. So the first thing I picked up as we went in had um, a lovely selection of um, artificial flowers. Home Sense usually have really, really nice artificial flowers and they did not let me down. Obviously, because Christmas has now been and gone, they've got a lot more stock in. I didn't particularly need any, but I had to pick some up. So I got just this, um, I don't know what it's actually called, like David Bellamy. <laughs> um, it was 3 99 Um, I just wanted like this, um, a bit of greenery to go into um, a vase. My mum actually got me, I'll have to show you, it wasn't from Home Sense, she got it in the other day. Um, it's this beautiful marble vase how gorgeous is that this was actually from home bargains i love home bargains and she picked it up for me because i'd seen i'd seen them a lot on um, instagram and the home bargains nearest to us didn't have them but she went to one and she found them so she picked me one up so i wanted some flowers to go in there but i wanted to keep them quite neutral because it's marble so I was thinking, I can split, think I might split these because I want to put some into some other of my vases. And then I got three of these ones. They look a bit like miniature hydrangeas, if you will. I don't know if the camera's a bit bright there. And again, these were $3.99. So I thought they would go nice clumped together in my vase. I got three of those. I don't know where I'm going to put my vase yet. What did I find next? Oh, couldn't resist this. I have no idea where I'm going to put it, what I'm going to use it for, but it was with all the artificial um, flowers and the plant pots and things like that, but I couldn't resist it. How cute is that? That is just adorable. I thought oh, it would look cute somewhere in my I think I don't know whether to put it in the front room or to put it in my bedroom. Not quite sure, to be honest. But I might put a little plant in it. I don't know, but I just couldn't resist it. I suppose I could even put some makeup brushes in because it will go in my bedroom. I've got little bits in my bedroom in pink. So, but I couldn't leave it. I just thought it's just too cute to leave. And that was um, 4 99 and then in the same aisle, I also saw this little guy and it's a little bear. And again, I think it's meant to be a plant pot. He was also 4 99 Toby's bedroom, I've done it all in like um, a bear theme. Um, I've brought, well, I've done mainly bear, a couple of other um, animals in there, but mainly bear just to make it a bit older because uh, it was all like just stars and everything before we moved in the old house and baby blues and it was a bit babyfied. So now we've moved into this new, the new house. It was just like a blank canvas, everything was white and grey. So I've just updated his decor and made everything um, bare orientated just to make it a little bit older for him. So I thought that would look cute on one of his um, shelves. Maybe I put a little plant in it or something, but I just thought that was too cute to not take home with me. And then... I found these marble coasters. They are gorgeous. Again, it doesn't really pick up very well on the camera, but they're like trimmed in silver. You can see it a little bit all the way around. And they're so heavy. And they must be like the proper proper marble on top. And they were $6.99 and you get four. Again, I'm not sure I might put them in my front room or I might put them in the bedroom I'm not sure I suppose I could do both I could split them but I thought they were they were lovely though and then as I said in my vlog you can't go to home sense and not get a candle but I can't smell it no nothing can't smell it it's called gardenia 
and it's by a brand DW Home. It was five ninety nine. Doesn't have. I don't think has it got a description on. Mm, no. Doesn't have a description of what's actually in it. But I thought being gardenia, it's only going to be flowers, and so I thought it would be really, really nice when it burns. They usually are from Home Sense, but. I'll keep you posted on that one when I burn it and I can start smelling things again. And then last but not least, when I was going down to the till, <clears throat> I spotted this bad boy. And the fact that it had the word skinny in it is everything. I think I mentioned in my, one of my first videos, um, Gemma Louise Miles, I think she uses this. And she said it's absolutely amazing I've not tried it yet because I can't taste anything um, but it says there's actually no calories and no sugar in it and it just says it's like a whipped foam topping so just like for a proper cappuccino that the fact that there's no calories in there I do Slimming World so it must be Slimming World friendly I've not actually looked it up on the app to check but there's no calories in it and there's no sugar so I can't see it being actually having any sins in it I wouldn't have thought really and that was 4 99 but you get 475 mil so you get a lot I don't I drink a lot of coffee but I don't drink that much I have to do a video sometime on Slimming World I've lost just over three stone um in a year and is it a year and a half I've been or two years no a year and a half I've lost three just over three stone um, it's taken taken a while but I've got there so I'm going to push for a four stone and then I'll be happy I think that's what I got from Home Sense like I said it wasn't a lot because I just my heart wasn't in it if I'm honest I was just walking around and I was starting to feel rubbish and I just wanted to get back home and then I saw that it started sleeting and snowing so I'd had enough I'm gonna take off my makeup put on some comfies I've put some soup in the microwave chicken soup always makes you feel better when you've got a cold doesn't it so, even though I can't taste it. So, I'm going to go and have that, a cup of tea, and just chill out for an hour while Toby has his nap. And yeah, hopefully in my next video, I will feel a lot better and be a lot brighter. Thank you very much for watching and coming to Home Sense with me, even though it was quite a short visit. But I shall see you in the next video. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you would like to subscribe, I would really, really appreciate it. So yeah, take care and I'll see you next time. Bye!